That's my grandpa in Iran. Today, I'm flying there. I haven't been in years. The most common direct flight to Tehran is Istanbul, Doha, and Dubai. That's where I'll be flying from. They also have flights from Paris and Frankfurt too. I'll be spending two weeks here visiting different places and seeing relatives. My parents grew up in Tehran, but they met in the US while studying in university. They married in Tehran, but settled in the US where I was born. I'm flying on this airline called Mahan. It's an Iranian airline and will be the first time I've taken it. I'm able to enter on my Iranian passport. And this is not your boarding gate. Although many nationalities can apply for visas and go with a group tour. The flight is about two hours. They play this video before we land. She stamps my passport within a few seconds, and next, it's baggage claim. And now I step foot in Iran. I take a taxi to my grandpa's house. Haven't seen my grandpa in three years. Uh, I think we're approaching. It should be it should be good. Feels feels really nice to be back. This is my dad's dad. <laughs> but for dinner, we go see my mom's side. Okay. We go to this restaurant. My mom has 46 first cousins alone. Tonight, we see some of them. Chi. <laughs> do. It's a yogurt drink popular around the Middle East. Uh, nice. <laughs> My cousin Navid is an architect. I spend a whole day with him later on, so make sure to subscribe to this channel to see that. Navid studied in Malaysia and now is living back in Iran. <laughs> my grandma and your grandma were sisters. Yeah. And my grandpa and your grandpa brothers. Yeah. And with, you know what that means. It's so complex, I know. <laughs> you know what that means. We have the same great grandpa and great grandma, right? Yeah. So we are cousins. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, at the same well, the, night. Yeah, the rumor has it that your grandpa and grandma were gonna get married. Yeah. And like a day, a week before, a few days before, they said, "Hey, take your brother, take the the grooms, take the groom's brother, yeah. take the bride's step sister, step, yeah. and let's <laughs> let's have two two weddings on one night." <laughs> at the same time. 
that's and that's like that's how my grandparents got married. Yeah, so yeah, such a funny story. I know. Yeah. Imagine just a week I, before I, I the wedding, that. like okay, let's just you know, yeah, YouTube. I, you have a brother. You have a sister. <laughs> One yeah. more wedding. I, I wish we were there to see that. I know. Yeah. I know. Only through our. <laughs> it was going to be so fun. Through our bloodline, yeah, we'll always we'll always have it within us somehow. <laughs> Explain what you ordered. It's a traditional food in Iran. It's combining of three different kind of kebab: juju kebab, kubide, and chenge. Yeah. You're doing great. Thank you. Samin, chimi khori. Chuje mal ki buda khori. Chuje bad. Samin is working for a telecom company here. You'll see more of her in my next video too. Shayan is a recent college grad, now working in tech here in Tehran. Who are your favorite YouTubers? Oh, it's, it's kind of getting hot here. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll join the frame. Who are your favorite YouTubers? Um, actually, you are one of my favorite YouTubers and uh, I mostly follow Matt Diavola and um, I don't know, in my industry and tech jobs, I follow those. I don't know if I have to name them or what. Yeah, give me some names, a few names. Okay. Uh, of course, I follow Marcus Brownlee. Oh, yeah. Because MKBHD. And um, I have a favorite programming channel which explains everything in 100 seconds. It's called Fireship, Fireship.io. And he's actually doing great. Um, yeah. And um, one more question. Oh, do you like working in tech? Mm, yeah, I absolutely love working in tech. Is it exciting? Mm, yeah, since it's a hot subject here. So. Yeah, it seems to be really developing now. Yeah, it's so cool. Growing so fast. <laughs> I know, I think he told me he's like, I love you. This is called Esfand. It's a Persian tradition where the herb is spread over someone's head and it is believed to fend off bad spirits and evil eyes. It's something your mother would do after dinner to you. This puts an end to our night and the end of my first day here, the start of my trip to Iran.